be the plan, that's what they call me I promise that you'll never be lonely Be the plan, that's what they call me heart shaped pizza that they have at Pizza Hut. We have some cookies, chocolate chip. We have some veggie pizza. We have some cheesy breadsticks. We have some wings. And we have some, um, and we have some pepperoni pizza. Okay, I got two um, cinnamon toast crunch. Um, it's a new item, some new items that was in Doc General, which was the Fanta and the gumbo base, um, Louisiana gumbo base. I got some Ziploc bags. I got some RSC soda, some Canada Dry, and Dr. Pepper. Um, I got two packs of four count mega rolls i got three palm olive um i got three palm olive dish detergents i got extra larger detergent and plastic plates a 30 count and that is it for this haul guys okay guys just wanted to show you what my um fiance won for me um in a giveaway um, a Juicy Couture bag. Really nice bag, guys. It's really pretty. Um, um, he won this giveaway from Brown Eyes on the Budget. And, you know, he, um, he won it and he gave this to me. Because, you know, he, a man. He not going to wear this first because he's a man, duh. But, um, this is so cute. I love the, um, it has, like, a coin on um, wallet and it's so pretty this black coin wallet and it, it kind of like went inside of the bag and the bag is so pretty i just love it i love the floral bag it's so pretty and it says juicy on it and then you open it up let me see this is what it looks like inside guys paper inside of course this is what it looks like inside really pretty bag guys really pretty and look at it it's like a little scarf to it too it's so pretty okay guys so i want to show you guys this valentine's day haul mostly i got valentine things from valentine's day um um i have three three strawberries because I'm going to be making chocolate um, chocolate um, covered strawberries. I got some semi-sweet chocolate chips and I have some shortening sticks. Um, I got some cheese. I got the Hershey's milk chocolate um, sir, um, icing. I have the strawberry ice, icing. I have yogurt and I have some um, peach yogurt and strawberry yogurt. I have bananas, vanilla wafers. I have Duncan Hines, strawberry mix. I have perfectly moist triple chocolate cake mix. I have fruit punch. I have some more fruit punch. Um, I got some of this stuff for Publix and some of this for Save a Lot. I got some cheddar cheese, um, Pringles. I have two cans of corned beef hash. I have some sweetened condensed milk. I got these from Publix. I actually got four. I drunk one already. The Twinkies iced latte. I don't really drink a lot of coffee, but um, every once in a while I drink some and I got this. I got these sprinkles from Publix, yeah. the Betty Crocker um, sprinkles, the yeah. stars. I got some whole wheat cinnamon raisin um, raisin bread. And that is it.
it. I already showed them that Aaron. That is it. And I forgot to show you the vanilla pudding. I'm gonna have some videos coming up with me and the kids. So stay tuned. Okay guys, I want to talk to you guys a moment about my grocery hauls. Um I have been getting a couple of comments telling me that I don't um give my kids food of nutritional value. Okay guys. I do grocery hauls, but that doesn't mean that what I have in my grocery hauls is what I is all that I have in my house, guys. Um I have other things in my house. I just choose to share some of the things that I get from the grocery store. I don't share everything that I get from the grocery store, guys. And these are my kids. I'm gonna have to raise them. If anything, if anything, I'm the one that has to deal with the consequences, not anybody else that's watching their channel. I'm grateful for each and every one of you guys who watch my channel. But you're gonna all I know you're gonna always have people, naysayers in your comments, and you're gonna always have somebody they try to, you know, give you, some people give you constructive criticism, but you can tell when it's constructive criticism and when, when it comes from a good place, and then you can tell when it's not coming from a good place. Um, people ask you for, they give you unsolicited advice that you don't even ask for. So that's something, if, if people, if it's anybody in this, this one that wants to be a YouTuber and feel like they're ready to be a YouTuber, be ready for things like that because people are not gonna always like what you put out. Um, some, every once in a while, it gets irritating with the comments, but a lot of people um, don't like that. If I don't like what you comment, I delete it. It's my channel. And if I wanna delete comments, if I wanna block you, it's this is my channel. And that's just how it is. If it's something that I don't like, I'm going to delete the comment. Um, I don't have to sit up there and just look at negative comments or comments that I don't really agree with. It's, it's my channel. Um, I'm not going to let anybody take the wheel of my channel unless they are helping me manage my channel. And I only have one other person um, and that's helping me manage my channel right now. But um, and that's, that's other than that. I'm not saying people can't have opinions, but when it's just so negative that I just don't like it, I'm gonna take it down. It's some if it's it's up to me what I want on my channel. And if whoever don't like it, you don't have to be here because if you leave, trust and believe it's gonna be somebody else that wants to watch my channel. And I'm not saying that in a, in a arrogant way because I don't have an arrogant bone in my body. And I'm just saying that the best the best way I can without being negative. But I appreciate those who do watch my channel and try to give me good advice and give me good pointers and things. But it's a lot of people out here, they try to act like they are giving you advice, but it's like slick shade. And it's like, like I just don't understand somebody throwing shade. It's just a person that throws shade to me is got to be like a person with low self-esteem because they want you to feel bad. So, they already feel bad about themselves, so they want you to feel bad. But anyways, I didn't talked enough. And hopefully you guys enjoyed my little haul that I got for um, Valentine's Day. And little odds and ends that things that we didn't have in the house that we wanted to have in the house. Um, um, what else did I have to say? Nothing else that I had to say. Guys, I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Don't forget to, if you if this is the content that you like, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video. If not, God bless too. God bless you anyways, and I love you anyways. But thank you guys so much.